As a constructor, you will receive email notifications when the submittal items are stamped and back in your court. You can also find out which items are in your court at any time by going to the home page and look at the list of submittal items in your court. Click on the package number. Here is the list of items in the package. You can simply click on the paper clip icon and download the attachments for each item. Please go ahead and close the items which are approved or rejected. Please make sure that you and AE have the same understanding of the rejected items before you close. During the last six years, I have seen many professionals that interpret the rejected status differently. To avoid confusion, eBuilder has created two separate statuses, rejected versus revise and resubmit. Revise and resubmit means do not close the submission because AE is expecting a new version regarding the submittal item. In contrast, rejected means is a dead end submission and architect is not expecting any revision. When things are clear, click on the item that needs to be closed, go to the submittal item level, and hit close. As soon as the item is closed, this button turns into reopen, which means you can change your mind at any time, and you can always come back here and reopen the item. By the way, you may have noticed there is also an option to close items from the package level right here. Please do not touch this button. In some cases, you may have multiple items that you need to close. It may make sense to close them all by one click here, but please do not do that. There is a known glitch in eBuilder that may impact the closed items if you close it from here, from the package level. You need to avoid this until the fix is released and available. Now we close the first two items. The last one is mark revise and resubmit. Please select the revise and resubmit items. Either is one or multiple and then click on create revision. As soon as you do that, eBuilder is going to create a new package carrying over all the existing package information. If you noticed, the new package is now version one. Click here if you are interested to see the old package. As soon as the new revision is created, the old items are getting closed in the old package. Let's click back here to see the new package. The new items are also shown as revision 1. At this point, everything starts over. You can attach the revised documents and send the items for review again as we discussed in the previous video called prepare package and send for review. Please watch the video again if you need a refresher. That concludes our submittal module training. Hope you enjoy watching the videos. If you have any questions or you need any help with the submittal review process, please do not hesitate to contact us at ebhelp at umd.edu. Thank you for watching. See you next time.